I hope you're doing great. Welcome to this new lesson of the English language lessons on Onora TV. Nizar Kabbani called it the city of Jasmine. It is a real witness of a very long history. لقبها نزار قباني بمدينة الياسمين وهي شاهد على حضارات مختلفة إنها دمشق Aleppo is also one of the oldest cities in the world Arameans called it حلب الشهبة حلب أيضا هي أحد أقدم مدن العالم ولقبها الآراميون بحلب الشهبة Today we are going to talk about these two old cities Aleppo and Damascus اليوم سنتحدث عن أحد أقدم مدينتين في العالم حلب ودمشق Let's start the old city. First of all, let's start with the new vocabulary. في البداية دعونا نبدأ مع الكلمات الجديدة. This is the map of Syria. Damascus is the capital of Syria. It is located in the southwest of Syria. Aleppo is located in the northwest of Syria. Aleppo, Halab. Repeat. Aleppo, Aleppo. Damascus, Damascus, Dimashq. Repeat, Damascus. Let's continue. Look at these high buildings and the big square. It's a big city. City, Medina, city, city. Can you give me some names of cities? Yes, Gaza, Damascus, Aleppo. Homs, Ramallah, all of these are cities. Let's continue. This is a church. Church, Kanisa. Repeat, church, church. Christians usually go to church on Sundays. Church. Let's continue. Mosque, Masjid. Listen, mosque, mosque. Muslims go to pray in mosques. Mosque. Let's continue. Look at these old rooms. They are very old. Very old means ancient. قديم جدا أو أثري. Ancient. 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 Beautiful faces. Both faces are the same. 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 Both faces are the same. You get these girls, they are doing different activities. Different. So, the opposite of same is different. The opposite of same is different. Let's continue. There is no water in this land. It's dry. But his shoes got wet in the rain. Dry. Jaff. Wet. Rattled. Dry is the opposite of wet. Dry is the opposite of wet. Everyone knows Superman. He's a famous character. Famous, famous, mashhur, well known, famous. The temperature is 50 degrees here. Temperature, temperature, درجه الحراره. Temperature. Let's continue. This is the sea and this is the land. This is the sea level, مستوى سطح البحر. This house is above sea level, above sea level, فوق مستوى سطح البحر. Above sea level, above sea level. Now, let's revise the previous words. Damascus, Aleppo, mosque, church, wet, same, city, ancient. Let's read them again. The mosques, Aleppo, mosque, church, wet, same, city, ancient. Let's continue. Famous, above sea level, temperature. Again, famous, above sea level, temperature. Now let's move to an activity. Fill in the spaces from the list. Let's read the words in the list. Wet, city, ancient, mosque, temperature, church, same. 
Let's have the first sentence. Look at this old, very old building. The opposite of modern is what? Pretty good, ancient. The opposite of modern is ancient. Let's continue. Damascus is a very ancient city. Yes, very good, city. Damascus is a very ancient city. Let's continue. The rooms is about 24 degrees. 24 degrees, temperature is very good. The temperature is about 24 degrees. Let's continue. Beautiful girls and beautiful dresses. These dresses are almost the same. Yes, very good. These dresses are almost the same. Let's continue. Look at his shoes. My shoes got wet or dry. Very good, wet. My shoes got wet in the rain. My shoes got wet in the rain. Let's continue. Umayyad, mosque or church? Look at the picture. Very good, it's a mosque. Umayyad mosque is very famous. Umayyad mosque is very famous. Now, let's stop here and have a short break. This is the map of Syria. Where is Damascus? Yes, here it is. Where is Aleppo? Very good. It's in the northwest. Now, we are going to read the passage, then answer some questions. Be careful. Damascus and Aleppo are the two biggest cities in Syria. The two cities are very old and have a long history. We don't know which city is older. They both have many famous ancient buildings. Let's read it again. Damascus and Aleppo are the two biggest cities in Syria. The two cities are very old and have a long history. We don't know which city is older. They both have many famous ancient buildings. Now, let's move to the activities. Read and decide true or false. Damascus and Aleppo are the two biggest cities in Syria. Is it true or false? Let's go back to the passage. Damascus and Aleppo are the two biggest cities in Syria. So, the answer is true. Yes, very good. Let's continue. What are Damascus and Aleppo famous for? Let's have the choices. One, both are famous for their very hot weather. Number two, both are famous for many ancient buildings. Which one is the correct one? Let's go back to the passage. They both have many famous ancient buildings. They both have many famous ancient buildings. So, the correct one is number two. Let's continue. Get from the passage. The opposite of smallest, the same meaning of well-known, and the opposite of modern. Let's go back to the passage. What's the opposite of smallest? Very good, biggest. And what's the same meaning of well-known? Where is it? Very good, famous. And what's the opposite of modern? Yes, perfect. It's ancient. Now, the opposite of smallest is biggest. The same meaning of well-known is famous. And the opposite of modern is ancient. Let's continue. Let's read this passage and answer some questions. Summer temperatures are about the same in Damascus and in Aleppo. In winter, Aleppo is colder. The temperature is about 11 degrees. Aleppo has more rain than Damascus in winter, so it is wetter. Let's read the passage again. Summer temperatures are about the same in Damascus and in Aleppo. In winter, Aleppo is colder. The temperature is about 11 degrees. Aleppo has more rain than Damascus in winter, so it is wetter. Read and decide true or false. Summer temperatures are different, notice here, different in Damascus and in Aleppo. Is it true or false? Let's go back to the passage. Summer temperatures are about the same 
in Damascus and in Aleppo? So the answer is false, yes. Which city is colder in winter, Aleppo or Damascus? In winter, Aleppo is colder, Aleppo is colder. So, which city is colder in winter? Aleppo is colder. Let's continue. Get from the passage the opposite of different. Let's go back to the passage. Where is the opposite of different? Same, yes, very good. So, the opposite of different, same, very good. It refers to, let's go back to the passage. It, let's read the whole sentence. Aleppo has more rain than Damascus in winter, so it is wetter. It refers to, very good, Aleppo. It refers to Aleppo. So, the answer is Aleppo. Let's continue. Let's read the third passage, then answer some questions. The two cities have beautiful mountains, farms, trees, and rivers near them. Damascus is at a higher level than Aleppo. It is 700 meters above sea level. Let's read the passage again. The two cities have beautiful mountains, farms, trees, and rivers near them. Damascus is at a higher level than Aleppo. It is 700 meters above sea level. Let's move to the activities. What do Damascus and Aleppo have? What do Damascus and Aleppo have? Let's go back to the passage and find the answer. The two cities have beautiful mountains, farms, trees, and rivers near them. So the answer is both have beautiful mountains, farms, trees, and rivers near them. Let's continue. Read and decide true or false. Aleppo isn't as high as Damascus. Aleppo isn't as high as Damascus. Let's go back to the passage. Damascus is at a higher level. Damascus is at a higher level than Aleppo. So the answer should be very good, true. Aleppo isn't as high as Damascus. Damascus is 900 meters above sea level. Let's find it where? It is 700 meters above sea level. It's 700. So the answer should be false. Yes, very good. Let's continue. Them refers to. Let's go back to the passage. Them. Let's read the whole sentence. The two cities have beautiful mountains, farm trees, and rivers near them. So, them refers to the two cities. What are the two cities? Very good. Aleppo and Damascus. So, them refers to the two cities, Aleppo and Damascus. Let's continue. Let's read the fourth passage. Damascus, which is also called as the city of Jasmine, is famous for its seven gates, Umayyad mosque, and very old churches. Where the river flows through the city, the whole city can be viewed from Mount Cassium. Let's read the passage again. Be careful. Damascus, which is also called as the city of Jasmine, is famous for its seven gates, Umayyad mosque, and very old churches. Where the river flows through the city, the whole city can be viewed from Mount Cassion. Let's move to the activities. What is Damascus famous for? What is Damascus famous for? Let's go back to the passage. It is famous for its seven gates, Umayyad Mosque, and very old churches. So the answer is, what is Damascus famous for? It is famous for its seven gates, Umayyad Mosque, and very old churches. Let's continue. What's the name of the famous mosque in Damascus? Again, what's the name of the famous mosque in Damascus? Let's find it. Umayyad Mosque is yes, very good. Umayyad Mosque. Let's continue. Read and decide true or false. 
Damascus can be viewed from Mount Cassion. Damascus can be viewed from Mount Cassion. Let's go back to the passage. The whole city can be viewed from Mount Cassion. And this is a picture from Mount Cassion. So the answer, true, is very good. Now, with the last passage, let's read it together. Aleppo, which is also called Halab Shahba, is famous for its castle, khans, old mosques, and old churches. Let's read the passage again. Aleppo, which is also called Halab Shahba, is famous for its castle, khans, old mosques, and old churches. Let's move to the activities. What is Aleppo famous for? What is Aleppo famous for? It's famous for its castle, khans, old mosques, and old churches. So the answer is, it is famous for its castle, khans, old mosques, and old churches. Now, let's stop here and have a short break. Welcome back. Complete from the passage. The two cities are very, let's go back to the passage. The two cities are very old. So the answer, the two cities are very old. Let's continue. Damascus is at, let's go back to the passage. Damascus is at a higher level than Aleppo. Damascus is at a higher level than Aleppo. So, Damascus is at a higher level than Aleppo. Now, let's move to another activity. Choose the correct answer. Choose the correct answer. Both cities have many famous towers, hotels, or buildings. What's the correct choice? Very good buildings. Let's continue. Aleppo has more rain than Damascus, so it is better or wetter or colder. Excellent! The answer is wetter. Let's continue. Aleppo is also called Halab al-Shahba, city of jasmine, black. Yes, very good. Aleppo is also called Halab al-Shahba. Flows through Damascus, Asi River, Nile River, or Barada River. What is it? Very good. Barada River flows through Damascus. Now, let's have another activity. Find the mistake and correct it. The first sentence, Damascus is a very new city. Is it correct to say new? New is the mistake. What's the correct answer? Damascus is a very old city. Very good. Damascus is famous for its four gates. Is it correct to say four gates? No. Seven gates. Damascus is famous for its seven gates. Let's continue. Damascus is also called as the city of roses. No. The city of jasmine. Damascus is also called as the city of jasmine. Syria, the country of love and peace. God bless you. Goodbye.